Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to change the price of your products on Shopify. In Shopify, changing the price of your product is pretty easy, but then there are a lot of things that you need to consider in pricing your product. If you ask people to pay too much for your product or service, and they will stop buying. Ask too little, and your profit margin slides, or customers assume that your product is poor quality. An optimum price factors in all your cost and maximizes your margins while remaining active to customers. There are three main things that you need to consider. First is knowing the market. You need to know how much your competitor charge and how much customers are willing to pay. Second is to choose the best pricing technique. You need to decide which approach is most suitable for your products or service before making a calculation. The last one is to work out your cost. Calculate your cost first and if possible, if you can lower it down, then do it. Once you have everything figured out, then let us walk you through in changing the price of your products on Shopify. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. What you need to do first is to access the Shopify admin. Log into your Shopify account at www.shopify.com. Once you're in, click the products section on the left to view all your products. Look for the product that you wanted to reprice and select it. Just click on the product name. On the product detail page, scroll down to the pricing section. Set up the price. The price is the actual price of the product and it's optional but recommended to set up a compare price. When you set a compare price, the product listing updates on your online store to show that the item is on sale. The value in compare at a price must be higher than the value in price to show a sale price. Once you're done setting up your price, click the save button located in the top right to save your changes. You should see a prompt at the bottom saying that the product changes were already saved. When you visit the item in your online store, you should see that the item is listed on sale. The higher price, which is the compare at price, has a strike through, and beside it is the actual price, which is what you set up earlier. So that's it. That's how you change your product prices on Shopify. Just so you know that we have a lot of tutorials and webinars on bits of advice on how to run and the applicable techniques for your e-commerce business. You can always visit our site at sellerschoice.digital and browse through our huge compilations of webinars, tutorials, and blogs. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay tuned. See you soon!